People of God, I celebrate you very, very seriously. This is the very son of the great gospel general, Apostle Professor Johnson Suleiman. You are addicted to alcohol. There are <laughs> a man gave a testimony in, in Tallahassee, in Florida, and his testimony was that he is surprised that since he has been in the program, he has not smoked. But he has not smoked. It was a testimony. That was the second day, and he has not taken a stick of cigarette. He has not smoked. Smokes every day. Sticks packets every day. There are people that must drink every day. You must take champagne or you must take Hennessy every day. Every day. You must give the devil bond offering every day. Not just imagine somebody for the past couple of years have been addicted to smoking and drinking. Let's say to one brand, let's, let's say Hennessy or let's say Champagne. You've been doing that every day for the past three years. You spend hundreds of thousands, probably millions on that. All you do is to drink and drop the empty bottle. Somebody in that company didn't spend up to half of that amount and is a shareholder. In that company is a shareholder. You are donating and empowering a company to grow at the expense of your life. It's so bad now that even women are smoking. Yeah, actually fulfilling that what a man does, a woman can do better. Women are smoking. It's so normal now. Responsibility. Can I say this to you? Even without the thought of heaven, it is profitable and more economical to live righteous. Even without the thought, thought of heaven. Let's put heaven aside. It is economical, profitable to live long. As a young man, I want you to sit down now and calculate how much you have given to young girls. Just imagine you gave half of that. Imagine you gave half of that to a woman. Your mother, your sister, your auntie. See the prayer they would have prayed for you. But you carried a full iPhone and charger and gave to somebody's child. And your mother is using a phone with rubber band. Full phone. See how much you don't have sense. I'm being honest to you. As a young lady, just imagine how many young men you have cooked for. No, do you know what it means? Hold on. Do you know what it means? Wait, 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 wait. Do you know what it means as a girl, as a young lady, not to have self-esteem? Anybody that opens teeth for you, you sleep with. Anybody, imagine four guys sitting down. They are talking and you are passing. And the four of them have slept with you. What? You can't pass that road. You can't pass that road. What a shame. You keep yourself and say no to immorality. Even if there's no money in your pocket. Because tomorrow you want to be able to walk well with respect. Five boys are talking. All of them are sitting there and you're walking past and they burst into laughter. They burst into laughter. Because that thing in between your legs is supposed to be private part. But what you are carrying is local government area.